this video, I'm going to go through the addition and subtraction video overview. So using this overview, I'm going to create some videos using open-ended questions and some activities for students. Video number one is going to be purely for counting. A very important part of counting is to consciously use the zero. Starting from zero, you count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, counting up. Also counting down is important. Another imp important part of counting is counting from, for example, from number four, you count up five, six, seven. If you're counting up from five, from five, and the six and the seven. Video number two, we're going to go through the joining sets. For example, four plus two is four and two more, four plus two equals six. And another important part is of course, using the five. Because we have five fingers on one hand, using utilizing the five or frame of five is extremely important. So four plus two using the five frames is four plus two is exactly the same as five plus one. The video number three is about subtraction. The students are going to go through two concepts. One is separate model and we, the other one is the compare model. So the five is separated into three and two. And compare five and two, which is larger than how many. Video number four is a very important one. Students are going to go through the concept of utilizing the 10. So one 10 is exactly the same as 10 ones. Hence 15 is made out of 10 and five. 12 is 10 plus two. And other around 10 plus two equals 12. Well, this is number five. It is hard to see. That's my apology. Number five is about addition. We're going to add one digit number and one digit number. Utilizing the, the frames of 10. So for example, eight plus five is going to be ten plus three, which is thirteen. Now this is 28 plus three. So two digits plus one digit. So now using the concrete material as well as the uh, drawing represent representation, students can see 28 plus three is 20 and eight and two are added to 10, then the answer is 31. Video number six is again subtraction. Students are going to go through a two digit number, take away a 10 or tens. We're going to use a separate, separate model. So 42 and take away 10 from the pile. The answer is going to be 32. You can use a compare model, which is 
42 and a 10. 42 is 32 more than 10. So answer is 32. Somehow I wrote 31, but it's, I mean, 32. So video number seven, we're going to use base 10 blocks. So example is 56 plus 25. So it is important to use concrete material. Also the drawing representation. So 56 plus 25 using the five and a four to make 10. The answer is 81. Also expanding model of addition is extremely important. So 56 is 50 plus six, 25 is 20 plus five. Adding together is 81. Video number eight. So we practiced the partial sums in the last video. So for example, 60 plus eight plus 20 plus five. Now students realize that this method is not very efficient. Hence, some of students start having a shortcut. This is what we usually do. Video number nine, we're going to practice subtraction using the partial model. So how does it work? Let's use a separate model. So we have 81. We're going to take 25 out of it. So now we have only one that we want to take five. Well, I meant four more. However, so important part is the fair trade between the 10, 110 and 10 ones. Let's see how it works with the partial model. 81 is 80 plus one, 25 is 20 plus five. One take away five, we cannot do it. So we're going to do a fair trade with 110 and 10 ones. Again, student may have a bit of frustration how inefficient this is and they may start a shortcut. And number 10 is subtraction again, this case with the larger numbers. So 526 take away 347. If students need to use the concrete materials, Please let them use the base 10 blocks. Take away 300. Take away 40, we need 20 more. So we have a fair trade of 10 tens and 100. 40 is taken away, now seven, we need one more. So the 10 is going to be broken into 10 ones. So the, the answer is 179. Now partial model. 526 is 500 plus 20 plus 6. 347 is 300 plus 4 plus 7. Now partial model, understanding a partial model, model is extremely important.
Now, some advanced students or those students have deep understanding, they can easily work on four digits, take away four digits. Again, the shortcut. So this is a overview of the addition and subtraction videos. You'll find new videos about addition subtractions uploaded very soon.